We all know oil prices have taken a hit, and while many in Houston worry about the effects of cheap oil, for some it's a chance to snatch up another asset. Ranch land and ranch sales are booming. Sarah Donchi joining us now with a look at how you can get in on the action here. Sarah? Yeah, Bill, lots of people curious about this and travel from the city to the country about 90 miles northwest of Houston in rural Washington, Chapel Hill, and you'll find this gorgeous ranch for sale right now. Raised my family here. Donnie Roberts has owned the Texana Ranch for over two decades. My little story got married here. Let me kiss your wife. My son fished and hunted here. Holding back tears, he explains why now it's time for him to sell. His kids have grown up. It's just different when no one's around. He hopes to sell it to another family to create their own beautiful memories. The multi million dollar Texana Ranch will go on the market during a busy time. But you don't need to be a millionaire to have your own piece of land. Sales continue to be strong. With oil prices still struggling and the up and down stock market, more people are choosing real estate as a better, safer place to park their money. Jeff Boswell is a broker with Republic Ranches. He says sales are up 30%. Part of it, we think, is the low interest rate environment. Uh, there's not a lot of choices for where people are putting money. And I think people look at ranches as a storage of wealth. But how far will your money go? At Texana Ranch, you'll find an 1836 plantation house, a 5,000 square foot party barn, a lodge, a separate house for scrapbooking, even a 26 acre lake stocked with bass. So, who's the typical client? 10, 15, 20 years ago, it typically was farmers and ranchers own most of the properties around Texas. And what we've seen occur over the last 20 years is a lot more folks that live in the cities are now looking to buy land in the countryside. If you're looking at a ranch that's top of the line, closer to the city of Houston, you can expect to pay as much as $20,000 an acre. For something a little bit more economical, look towards South Texas, where you could spend about $1,500 an acre. But there's not much on it. There, there might be a jackrabbit or two, and that's about all you got. You'll have to build, but think of it as a long term investment. It really comes down to what purpose are you looking for in a ranch? If you're looking to be able to bring the family out, raise the family, have it year round, a place like this is phenomenal. If, if you're looking to part money somewhere where you might get a small return, then maybe looking at a cattle ranch or a hunting ranch that does provide you know, two or three percent return on your investment. For Donnie Roberts, selling his ranch is more than a business transaction. It's in your soul. Once you get connected to the dirt and you know every tree on your property, you know every piece of water on your property, and you know all your plains where you put your flowers out for your wife, and where you, uh, If you want to get a closer look at the Texana Ranch, like that 5,000 square foot party barn, we've posted a slideshow tour on clicktohouston.com. Look for this story on the front page. Sarah Donchi, KPRC Channel 2 News.